Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to Lutz Diary Adventure in the Philippines. So today, as you can see, I am on my way home to my sister, beloved sister, because I need to clean my nails. There's, I discovered there's one woman clean the nails properly. So this is the, what is this? Uh, Bridge of Life, as you can see down. That is the connecting from Balibago goes to over here. So this is where we're going. And uh, this is the nice one over here is the shortcut. So you don't, you can't avoid like a long walk down to uh, MacArthur Highway. Because this one here is the most AC road to go in the O. And um, it's, it's, it, it's convenient, but it is not good to walk down here at night. It's gonna be rain. I will suggest to walk over here it's okay to walk at day Kuki is with me today so this is where we're heading up down to my beloved sister on what she does doing right now so let's keep going and hopefully I will achieve what I need to do over here okay guys tomorrow is gonna be disaster tomorrow is not a very good day to over here in our area which is Angela City because yesterday there's like today I uh, know yes earlier I mean earlier there is the um, what's that called barangay roaming around and telling us that we will having a uh, brand out brand out by 5 a.m. in the morning down to 10 o'clock at night so it means we don't have electric we don't have water because today this morning when you open the water it's kind of dark so they said maybe that's the one they're going to fix but tomorrow it's not gonna be a good day for both of us because we don't have electricity that long oh boy that's one thing no electric is old but <laughs> still no one can fix it properly you still gonna experience burn out over here in the Philippines but you know it is what it is nothing I can do about it I can fix it you know they are in the they are in power so they are in control so this is the area over here I remember that tree over there it was supposed to be a lot of roots but oh well it's not his it's not that tree season today it's gonna be like um <coughs> um mango oh, diba? mango yeah it's mango season today so as you see it's very very close my sister house is just close if you walk in this side but if you walk to the other side it's not that close so maybe because i try i take the trike over so, just to walk over here, it's not that far. I don't know what is this. I think that is kind of restaurant or canteen. I don't have idea. Seems like close now and then to afternoon or something, it's open. So, I don't know what is that. Over here in this area, they change a lot. Uh, another apartment going on. So, this is the place where you can find actually apartment were affordable for your wallet and of course it's up to you if you are willing to live in the environment where a lots of Filipino likes to do bejoki likes to raise cockro uh, ro uh, a roaster and rice to do like you know drinking it's up to you if you can handle that one and you are in like a budget if you can handle that one it's up to you uh, oh yeah <laughs> that one there is for me for me and for my mom uh uh no okay we gotta go to my sister okay where we are i don't know if they're sleeping hello i think they're sleeping huh hello Mother, you you just came here just to sleep, huh? Oh, we don't have any. We don't have any. Yes. 
Papalinis daw eh. Papalinis? No, fake lang yun. I fake it so you can come in. Hi, Lance. How are you today, Lance? The other one still si Buya. Why still uh, sleeping right now? Yeah. Itlog. Yeah. Oh, yes. Hi, Lee. Sorry to delay. Are you okay today? Yeah, si Buyawa is over here. Call it Buyawa. Yes. Yeah. So, we are just going to come here and we're gonna have like, uh, ano. We can't rush the, ano. You can't eat it, you? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm gonna have, uh, Maybe the she will going to buy a snack over here. Oh, egg, <laughs> egg, and uh, this one here. Maybe she will buy this one here. Oh, this. Oh, see this? That is she needs to buy for us. Right, Kyoki. Right. Kyo, okay, I have a question. Are you ready for a province life? Are you excited? No, you're not excited. Why? But I'm excited. Yeah, it's a province life. I know you've been in the province, but now you have another chapter in the province. Are you excited to play with your nieces? Oh, playing basa. Playing basa. Oh, oh, jog. Playing nails, playing nini, something like that. Yeah? So... You are excited to go to the province or I'm excited na palinisan yung ko. You're excited to clean your nails but you're not excited to go to the province. You will use to it, okay? Okay guys, we are just done over there at my sister's house. She's still the same, nothing really changed about her. Uh, right now as you can see, you will see the flag which colored purple and red. That is the meaning of Holy Week is coming next week. And also this one here is the, uh, oh, what's that called? It's a area where all the plugs go through, where a lot of people will go panatize, that's what they called it. Uh, there's this one here is goes to the church I forgot what that's called but they called it something but every corner you will see over here you will see like that one down there so that is the meaning of um, uh, the meaning of this one here is gonna be someone will going to sing all day long for seven days we're gonna go here too like see they're gonna put like a uh, Mary over there it's a uh, it's a thing where Catholic Church knows that one um, you see over here because this one is the arrow where I think if I'm not mistaken the church no actually the church in the other area so where all the people down like um do the plagitation <laughs> is they're going to stop that's a, a route to stop. They're like at stop every corner and stay there for like an hour, I know, 30 minutes, 40 minutes, then goes to the next hour. You see, there's like crosses over here. It's starting already. They're making cross already. So this one here, this is a cross down there. It's gonna be used next week. So next week you will see a lot of people, kids. Oh boy, she's like shy. Why are you shy? Mainit lang. Wait, okay, okay. So next week, ano ba? Gano mo kasi. So next week you will see a lot of people like like walking around with like different stuff. Like I don't know how what's that called? It's dirty called like panata where like people do this every year. Uh, I think I will say. <laughs> I will see I will just respect up what they really poor but if you're going to ask my opinion I don't really ag agree that kind of stuff but they believe in something like you know we knew they have the they're doing it every year like they have one wish 
and the chains of that one wish is they do carry the cross for let's say 10 years or five years that's the that's the called panata because a lot of people say like uh, when they started doing the panata which is carrying everything whatever they likes to carry and or some other people they do like a plagiation where they cut the back and then they do like you know um uh they do like they cut the they cut their back and then they do like a, a bamboo strip and that's what they do in their back to make it bloody and some is like they carry two big cross and some is like they crawled on the ground uh, but that's what their panata every year for like a couple of years and of course according to them all the wishes they have is the band come true so that's their belief and we see this that's the route also they will stop and uh, I, th mm, I think uh, I think I'm not here to judge so whatever they believe for <laughs> and it's been going on over here in in Pampanga for how many 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 years since I can remember because that is also one of the known why Pampanga is is like crucifixion crucifixion oh my gosh I can't even pronounce it so anyway <laughs> I will go to pharmacy right now and buy my medicine okay guys we are finally back home it's funny when you know when girls when girls ask if uh, happen to be happy to move back uh, Kyuki said it's okay I mean like she said she had already experienced province style so it's not really surprising for her but uh, she will be used to it you know she will going to use to it one day or another because she I know I understand that they're going she will going to go to the new environment which is it's okay also because I have a lot of nieces down there to guide her for her first day of school and of course it's understandable for her feelings because she already has a friend over here as I said I would like her to go and be cautious for picking a friend like I mean being has a lot of friends that are not bad but you need to choose wisely who will be your friend so I would like as I said I would love her to uh, understand like whatever I does whatever I did to her is just for her own good because uh, right now I was like I'm kind of disciplining her who she choose to be friend and who to not so every time she will ask permission I will ask who the person is to go with but if I don't like really much the person I don't agree her to be associated with her for some reason you know I don't really like her girls who loves to course I hate it I don't do curse a lot of course if I was very very high for or I'm very angry yeah if I was angry yes I did but just to course is like habit I don't like that and I don't want her to be involved with that kind of stuff like you know it's as I said I want I don't want her to be influenced with that kind of society so there's like people out there were saying oh you should how did you think how did you think about going back down there and into the environment and something like that oh boy you should just shut up okay I know what's the best for her I've been with her 24 hours 365 days I know exactly what kind of person she is you have any idea because you only see 14 to 15 minutes of the video not the whole day and not the whole life we have over here so I think it's not for you to judge and it's not for you to decide for her I am going to decide because I am her guardians okay so that's about for today thank you thank you so much everyone thank you for following our journey I can't wait to be out in this kind of environment that I have right now because I would love to start a new life uh, kind of adventures interesting things like um, uh, <coughs> um, do interesting stuff new things for me like uh, uh, survivor in the jungles you know learn a lot of different stuff so that is the main race uh, main reason or the the purpose of my life I would like to be soon so thank you so much and I hope that you will also uh, follow that journey 
and thank you and once again have a good day and stay safe